I always refer to the photograph and try to match it. Anna Marie Peterson could be reading or watching TV. Just over this brush. But she'd rather be doing this. I tell everybody that I started when I was 93 with this. That was a new project. And it, it's never too late to start. It's called needle felting, and the 102-year-old great-great-grandmother from Sun City has gotten pretty good at it. Oh, sure, anybody can touch. Nine years ago, Anna Marie's daughter insisted that the retired church organist find a new hobby. It was a match made in fabric heaven. You need to keep busy with something. You need to challenge yourself to do something. Here's how it works. Anna Marie will find a photograph of a unique animal, flower, or sunset, then use patches of wool to recreate the image. This is my pet monkey, is a snow monkey. She showed us some of her award-winning creations that catch a lot of people by surprise because you can actually pet the picture. And they usually look at it thinking it's just another painting until they get up close and see the fuzz. And then I tell them I paint with wool. The up-and-coming artist has already had more than 60 pieces displayed in art galleries around the valley. She even sold a few, pocketing the cash for potential bingo money. So how much longer can this needle felter keep creating these inspiring works of art? Maybe until she's 110, when it's time to take up a new hobby. My father lived to be 106, and my mother's sister lived to be 103. So I have good genes. That helps me be happy, and if I'm happy, I'm well. Jason Berry for Arizona's Family.